have a one-on-one -on -one date with Sean today. This is the moment I've been waiting for. I want Sean to get to see a different side of me and just to go into my past and talk about my adoption and my family. And I want him to see that positive side of me that when things do go down a path that's not expected or that's hard, that you don't have to look at life bitter. And everything I've dreamed of and everything I want, I, it's crazy that I think it's happening. I really think it's happening. Honestly, nothing will and can go wrong today. Oh. Oh God, oh God, oh my God. Someone hurt? I know, I don't know. I'm in the kitchen waiting for Sean to come and we hear a big bang in the house. Tiara oh took a big fall and she just looks totally out of it. I just pray and hope that she's okay. Oh no, she's gotta she go. Oh, she fell down it? Yeah. Something is serious. I feel bad because I really want to make sure that Tira's not hurt. Morning. You okay? I'm on my way to pick up Ashley. I walk into the house, and apparently seconds before I walked in, Tierra fell down the stairs and hit her head. Are you all right? I'm trying to talk to her to make sure she's OK. I'm asking her questions, and she's really not responding. She might have a concussion. You know, as a guy who's had several concussions, my first thought is we need to get her to a hospital. Right. Uh, I'm worried about Tierra, but I'm definitely disappointed that it happens on my one on one date with Sean today. Talk to us. She's complaining of pain to her uh, right arm, but I don't see anything. Stand up. There you go. There you go. Okay, twist. I am fine. Mm -hmm. Lean back. Let them I don't do it. Do no, no, ma'am, you got us. Don't worry about it. We got you. We got you. I don't want to do this, though. Lower. Yes. Slow your leg. Lower. There you go. OK. We're almost there. Okay. Don't. Get straighten your legs out. No. Look this at me. is so okay. stupid. Real quick, look at me. I just want to be left alone. Just really quick. We'll run you over to Los Robles and Thousand Oaks. Get a quick x-ray. I don't want to go there. It's not necessary. So let me out of here. If the medics are telling me that I need to for sure come with them, I would definitely go to the hospital and make sure I was OK. And I thought it was interesting that she did not want to go to the hospital. We're going to take this collar off. OK, you know that us doing this could cause you further injury, right? You understand that? Yes. Tiara, I really, I really, I really want to recommend that you just no. go to the hospital. No. I don't really know whether she's hurt or not. I have no idea. But she like popped up and was like, OK, Sean's here. Like, I mean, maybe Sean is her magic potion. I don't know. So no other injuries or anything? No. OK. I think Tiara is the boy that cried wolf. I think that's her way to grab attention. And I'm a smart woman. I can see through it. Hey. It's going to be OK. You feel pretty good. You don't need to go to the doctor. I know it's embarrassing. She will go as far as she can, minus the hospital. Because she knows when she gets there, this is a skilled medical team that knows, you know, clearly nothing's really wrong with you, little doll. Do you still remember my name? Sure. <laughs> I mean, poor Ashley, she's waiting in the kitchen for her date. And it's now all about Tiara. I wish you hadn't have fallen. Glad we got this little time together, though. Kind of worked out <laughs> in benefit of me. Yeah. She start falling down the stairs more I often. Know. Maybe Sean will come over. <laughs> yeah, you better remember this. It just seems like this is lasting forever. I feel like I've been waiting all day. Like, how much longer do I have to wait for my day with Sean? Start wearing a helmet from now on. I know. <laughs> um, but if I get a date with you, I'm totally going to wear a helmet. I just have no sympathy anymore. She thinks it's cute to play the victim. 